God in his sovereignty has brought someone into my life. Congratulations are in order for Dr. Tony Evans. The 74-year-old pastor recently announced that he is engaged. Dr. Tony Evans is the founder and senior pastor of the Oak Cliff Bible Fellowship in Dallas, Texas. He is the author of numerous best-selling books, including, Your Comeback, Your Past Doesn't Have to Determine Your Destiny, and, Discover Your Destiny. In January 2020, his wife of over 40 years, Lois Evans, passed away after a very public battle with cancer. First Lady Lois was the founder of the Pastor's Wives Ministry at Oak Cliff and the First Lady Conference. She was honored in 1995 with the Good Samaritan Award from her alma mater Dallas Baptist University. And in 2000, she received the Status of Women Award from Sigma Gamma Rho Sorority Incorporated. Dr. Tony Evans and First Lady Lois had four children together. Crystal is a worship leader and author. Anthony Jr. is a Christian music artist. Jonathan was a professional football player and is currently the chaplain of the Dallas Cowboys. And their daughter Priscilla is a sought-after speaker and founder of Going Beyond Ministries. In 2015, Priscilla starred in the hit Christian film, War Room. After the passing of First Lady Lois, Dr. Tony Evans and his children published the book, Divine Disruption, Holding On to Faith When Life Breaks Your Heart. But after three years of sadness and heartbreak, Dr. Tony Evans has found love again. This time, with Dr. Carla Crummy. Not much is known about Dr. Carla Crummy at this time. Listen to Dr. Tony Evans announce his engagement to Dr. Carla Crummy during worship service at Oak Cliff Bible Fellowship. As I come up to the fourth year of the loss of Lois, my wife of 49 and a half years, it is a tender time. There are reminders everywhere of her life and of her influence on, on me, my family, and this ministry. We are a um, very uh, close family, and uh, all that has happened in my life, family, church, urban alternative, books, tapes, everything has been defined by, by her. So we've had the over these four years, the ups and downs and the roller coaster of emotions, sometimes high, sometimes low, uh, but that comes with it. Some of you have experienced it yourself with losses and coming through COVID because right after she passed was COVID and we had to deal with that as you did too. And I want to just thank so many of you who have been grievers with us and allowed us to grieve with you on some of your your times. And so that's, that's part of life. It was outside of our hands. We had to put it in the hands of a sovereign, sovereign God. And so as we work through, as I work through the ups and downs of, of uh, singlehood, uh, um, God in his sovereignty has brought someone into my life. And, um, This, uh, someone has traveled this similar road. In fact, she and her husband were on their way to Lois's funeral when her husband died. And as I've tried to share the ups and downs of my life with you, I wanted to share this and get you the opportunity to meet my new fiance, Miss Carla Fulmer. So, it's a sensitive time. It's a time when, because during the times like this, you also remind it of loss. And so I, I want your sensitivity as you pray for me, as we walk through this journey, as she walks through uh, the, the grief that she's had to walk through. I, I lost my father one month and then lost my wife the next month. She lost her mother one year, lost her husband the next year. So there have been a lot of similarities. And so uh, just, just pray for us. Uh, this may, uh, it's already invoked some grief in some people, which I can understand, because we're reminded about the fingerprints. Amen. 
the one thing I've appreciated about Sister Carla is that she has held Lois Evans high and honoring her legacy here.